Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys. And today guys, I will be showing you how you add bullet points to your website in Webflow. So yeah guys, make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end and follow my steps correctly. So you can make sure this works the same for you and that you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. The first thing you want to do guys is go ahead and open up the official webflow.com website right here if you haven't already. After opening up the website guys, you'll be greeted by this main page right here where you'll be able to see all of the options that you can access in Webflow. As you can see right here, I can see all of the websites that I have already created and here I have the button to go ahead and create a new website if I want. But for today's video guys, I'm going to go ahead and use this website that I have already created called YouTube Tutorials. I'm going to go ahead and open it up by clicking on Open Designer and now this will open up the website and the page. And if you look at the left side of the screen, you'll see the option that you can uh, see and add new elements to your website. You have the option to see your components, you can see your site settings and so on. And in the right side of the screen, you'll see the option to style those elements that you add to your website and design how your pages look. You even have the element settings and so on. So guys, as you can see, I have added a bullet point list right here. Now I'm going to be showing you how to do it yourself. What you want to do guys is go ahead and go, and go into the upper left corner and click on the plus button right here that says add elements. Go ahead guys and click on add elements and now this will open up this new page where you will have multiple elements that you can add. And what we want to do guys is go ahead and look under basic. And here you will see multiple elements and we want to choose either list or list item depending on what you need. I'm going to go ahead and choose a list. And as you can see, now this will automatically add the bullet points to the website. As you can see, it has automatically added the bullet points at the lower bottom of the page. Now you can go ahead and start typing what you want in your bullet points. You can even add more bullet points if you want and edit them as you want. But this is how you get them added and how to get started with using them. But yeah, guys, basically that's how you do it. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. So guys, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.